Oh, goody. All our parents are here. Come on, it'll be fun. Like a roller coaster. That's broken. <laughs> Where's that? He's parking the car. I was so excited, I got out while it was still moving. <laughs> oh, and there she is, my beautiful daughter in law. Oh, look at this. <laughs> my grandson must have quite an appetite. <gasps> Mom, could you please stop doing that? What? Fondling my wife's breasts. By the way, you might not want to serve anything too ethnic. Your grandmother's coming. Great! <laughs> Does Nan have to come to the brunch? Well, she's my grandmother, so yes. Couldn't she just meet us at church? It's so much closer to her house and... She's not going to insult your parents. Of course she will. Not on purpose. It's never on purpose, it just happens. Like the time she told my brother's girlfriend that Catherine couldn't possibly be a Jew name. It's a dog. It's for the baby. Picked him up at the local shelter. Dad, you don't bring people dogs. That's what I told him. Come, 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 every boy needs a dog. It teaches loyalty, stability. Dad, we can't have a dog. We're still trying to figure out Ian. Oh, kids are simple. All they want are three things. Food, sleep, and cartoons. Did I say candy? Four things. And toys. Where have I heard this sound before? Well, we're, we're married now. And frankly, it was his idea in the first place. Uh, what was? I don't know, whatever you're implying. Oh my God! Do you see this? Yeah, it's stunning. <laughs> no, 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 no. You will notice that the semi-precious stones, of which there are 263, have been hand-drilled and anchored to offset the reverse cross-stitching of the scallop trim. Did I just hear the baby? Now we have two outfits. That's twice as many as we have babies. Well, then we'll just pick one. Oh, is that all? <laughs> See, I, I thought we had a problem. I thought if we picked my mom's outfit that your mom would never forgive us, and if we chose your mom's, then my mom will have a coronary and die! <laughs> All right, all right, calm down. The christening isn't until tomorrow. That gives us all night to figure it out. It'll be fine. You think so? Absolutely. Uh-oh. You got that right. <laughs> hey, don't we need more lasagna? Let's go to the store. Great. Watch the baby, Mom. OK, bye-bye. Hey, perdón, ¿me puedes decir dónde tienen las galletas saladas? He wants to know what aisle the crackers are on. Oh, I know what he said, I just can't believe he said it in Spanish. He has sort of a Ryan Seacrest kind of look. Yeah, he's half Colombian, so he likes to show off. You know me las estoy dando? Yeah, you're showing off, aisle six. We're moving to New Kenya to be closer to you and the baby and be part of your lives on a day-to-day -day basis. Yeah, but should we go upstairs and tell Amy the good news? Oh, no, no. I mean, no. I'll tell her. It'll be fun for me. Can't believe how tired I am. Oh, thank God your parents are only here for four days. Yeah. I mean, any longer. I think I... Okay, night-night. <laughs> Why don't you take it? You had all the rest. You are amazingly alert for someone who's had a liter of wine. I keep waiting for those guys to confront me. Don't worry about it. If they've asked us what we've decided, just let me handle it. Okay. All right, we can't stand it anymore. Tell us which gown you have chosen. Sure. Of course, after a great deal of discussion and deliberation, we have decided... What? 
Oh, more ice. I can show you where that is. One sec. Who was he talking to? I don't know, but I'm gonna go check and then I'll come right back and tell you. Oh, no, you don't. You're not going anywhere until you tell us what we want to know. Did you pick mine? Or the one I made, the pretty one? It's like Andrew said, we were talking about it and, and... Nan, dear, everybody, dear! I brought a gift for the little guy. A christening suit. <laughs> I bought Ian a christening gown. And I made one by hand. Well, I guess you two are just quack out of luck because I'm the great-grandmother. <laughs> and I don't want my little guy wearing a gown. The next thing you know, he's smoking clove cigarettes and dancing on a float. <laughs> I'm not saying I was the prettiest rocket, but I kicked the highest. Jack Dempsey came backstage one day and said, hey, Gams, I'm taking you out for a steak. I said, I had one before the show, but what the hell? Hey, I got a social security check that's burning a hole in my purse. What do you say we blow out of here and go to Atlantic City? <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> You're that damn dog from before. <laughs> well, guess that means I'm driving. 